Yeah, I thought I'd just check in this morning. Um, we arrived uh, pretty much in the dark last night's campsite, which wasn't 100% ideal, but it was all good. We found a nice spot and set up. Um, wind's blowing. Must have brought it from uh, Elephant Sands with us. Um, but yeah, beautiful morning, just relaxed, had coffee, enjoyed the river. Um, last night, a few buffalo came through. Um, so yeah, very relaxing. Um, we're just about to head up now. We're going to go have some breakfast. Um, go for a drive along the river and find a place to have breakfast. So yeah, we'll see what we can uh, find along the riverbed. Um, it's normally pretty good out there. It's pretty dry at the moment, so there's not much other water. So all the animals are coming down to the river, so it's, uh, it's definitely the right place to be driving. And hopefully you'll we'll get lucky with some uh, little bigger game like some cats today. along the river and we're driving along one of the roads that got run just along the ridge above the river picked up quite a bit of lion spoor and then we just worked as a team to try and see if we could spot them uh, in the bushes between the river and the other road and Brad has come across a female Yeah, so we've come down to uh, the river. We're going on a boat cruise today. Uh, with Kalahari Tours, I think it is. Yep, Kalahari Tours. And we are heading out to one of the boats up or down the river. I'm not too sure yet, but uh, it's pretty hot, so it's going to definitely be a little bit of a scorcher. Um, but uh, yeah, this goes into the afternoon, so hopefully it'll cool down a little bit. Um, and yeah, boat safari is just another awesome way to see wildlife. Um, and look, watching them from the water is just a completely different experience. So, yeah, looking forward to this one. Um, should be good, and hopefully, we see something different along the way.
you can get to this on a boat. Absolutely incredible. Yeah, um, um, supporters up uh, on the bank. We look at the yeah, the fishy room in the background. Yeah, uh, Check this out. Check out close grounds. Every, uh, every afternoon they make sure they all across so that all the elephants that you're seeing over that side all cross back over to like the main side or the main band as such. Um, you know, it's just incredible how even the smallest of babies they cross with the adults and uh, somehow keep their trunks high enough in the water to get enough air to do the crossing. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's amazing, I mean you wouldn't see this. You can't even you can't drive here. So. You wouldn't be able to witness this in a car and on a boat, which is just incredible. I'll tell you what, you, you actually don't know where to shoot. There's, there's just elephants everywhere. Look at this behind us. Got these eggs in front of us. This is incredible, absolutely incredible. How amazing is that? We're busy watching elephants over there. We have a bit of an alarm call, and there's a couple of lions just on the other banks. <laughs> this place, I'll tell you. Absolute magic. Four. Four. No, five. five. Wow. Holy. Shit. Oh dear. <laughs> He what? must be seeing something else because why would he be parking there? Yeah, there might be the mail there, maybe. Okay. Check the vultures are already waiting, eh? <laughs> yes, how's that boy killing that thing? Yeah, that thing, you call that a big bunch connect. Jeez, guys. Jeez. Oh, I'll tell you what, it was a hell of a boat ride. Absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, you got to do it. You just got to do it. We might even book another one. It was that good. Just the, how close you get to the elephants, the completely different view you get. It's just so, so cool. So if you get, well, if you're anywhere, if you're safariing anywhere and there's a boat cruise or the river you can go on, go on it. It's well worth it. Um, it's not hugely expensive. Um, and it really just gives you a completely different perspective on things. Um, and we were just lucky today. I mean, lion kill, other lion on the side of the elephants, you know, getting a bit upset with them. So yeah, absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, and I uh, hope you enjoyed the images from the from the boat cruise. Interesting thing that Chobi actually 
flows both ways. I don't know that. And depending on how how much in flow the Zambezi is, depending on how and, and, and how much water comes up from there. Um, so they can't actually tell whether it's it's you know it's it's obviously come coming up or going down, but but yeah, very interesting. So yeah, learn something new, ask the questions, the uh, guide's very knowledgeable, and um yeah, had an awesome trip. driving up the road I just saw to my left a leopard and it's pitch dark we would never have seen it if the timing wasn't right and that's just like moral of a blue bush it's crazy right in this camp Thank you for watching another one of our episodes. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. In the next episode of this Chobi, Sabuti and Kwai series, we revisit the lion kill, battle a baboon in our campsite, and spend some more time in the incredible Chobi National Park of Botswana.